Hey there guys, today I am going to show you my newest invention called the TNT cannon. Um, one day I was just messing around with TNT for fun, um, trying to blow up some diamond ore. Didn't really work. Um, I just did it for fun, like I say, and it started to work and then I developed on my idea and then it finally worked. It's very basic, it doesn't go very far but it is quite impressive so all you need to do to start off is you need to get stone you need to get sand you need to get redstone dust you need to get a, bu a button either wood or stone i think it is and you need tnt as the name suggests tnt can okay and also you need water the water will act as a sort of slower down for the tnt because we don't want the tnt to just go off on us so when you press the button the tnt will just go boom in a word right so yeah you just make like a massive chamber for the tnt in the water um and then you put the water in at one end my god what is happening today right okay i'm, I'm gonna put the water in at this end okay so get your water out put it in right that's a tad too long so what you do is you stop it at there just the one just before it runs out so not not the one when it runs out the one before it runs out okay oh dear so there right so what you do then is you don't just do, you don't do that right you get two blocks this way and you do one block there and then you get your sand out because sand is just amazing for buttons and you do two blocks of sand get your button put it on the second block get your stone out again taking a bit of a plunge and again and you do like stepping st not stepping stones like steps you know, like stairs but without the stairs so you do like blocks going up diagonally and you get your redstone and you put one piece of redstone on each block no you do not do any on the floor because that will just cock it all up and then you just fill in these holes I don't like I don't like these holes right I'll resume the video after right okay I've filled in the holes and now what you got to do is you got to roll around all around sorry about the lag in there guys um yeah redstone all around the thingy the like container y sort of thing you don't need these two corner ones i just realized okay so then what you do is just go all the way around like so and if you miss any gaps out just go around again and then check if you miss any out um, and then when you test it that it's out of the button you if it stops about here and it starts to go a bit darker that's fine because that's what is that's what it is meant to do so if that happens don't go oh that's what's meant to happen okay right where is it here it is three so then you do the same as you did on that side okay so yeah on top of that button of destiny put the button on and then you test out the circuit okay so that's perfect okay i'm going to test out this one hello sheep that's brilliant so you put your tnt in i'm going to do two fires for you i'm going to show you how to reload it as well it's just the same how you put it in so 
I just feel like it. Yeah, it's basically really easy to reload it. It doesn't go very far, but it is really good. It's really funny to watch as well if it's a sheep. The sheep just go. Aah! That. See, I say it didn't go far, but that was like a wrong one, so I'll do two more because that was wrong. Right, okay. I've got to aim to get past that hole now. Right, let's go. Let's do this. If I can get in place the button. That's more like it. It got in the hole. How awesome is that? Right, now, the funniest thing to do is cover the hole with TNT. Okay? Just cover it all with TNT. Do every single last bit of it. Okay, so once I've filled it all up with TNT, I'll resume the video. Right, okay then. I've filled up that hole with TNT. And now, we get to blow it up. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and then that was my spacked hearted voice. Right. Just reload your cannon. Okay. Sorry if you can hear the last stand on the bugle. My dad's listened to this war thingy. Sorry about that. Okay. So yeah, set it off. No, it didn't set off. One minute. Yes, I think it's called the last stand. I'm not very good with war stuff. Right, let's go. Jesus Christ, it actually went further. What the hell are we gonna do? Right, I'm not, I, I swear, I'm not ending this video until I hit that. Why don't they do like TNT arrows? Because then if you like put TNT on the end of an arrow, if you fired it at the TNT from far, that would just be awesome. Right, okay. I might do a video on my, um, what you call it? Hunter's game, Hunter Games Arena, but I doubt I will. It missed again. Right now, I'm sorting this out. Okay. Right, let me pause and I'll sort this. Here you are, guys. See what? Whoa! Pity there wasn't a sheep in there. Now look how big that hole is. That hole is massive. Right then guys, thanks for watching my um, first video, um, hope you really liked it as normal and subscribe and you'll get more videos like this and tutorials on how to make pretty awesome structures such as Japanese houses, normal houses and possibly a cathedral. Okay guys, thanks for watching anyway and see you next time.